So hey guys, my name is Blaze. I run a digital agency helping fitness um, entrepreneurs and fitness influencers. And today I want to talk about you know how you can be successful in this digital age where you don't make your money with your you know your physical body with your strength, but you make your money with your brain, right? And um, I think what most people get wrong over here. Um, is could be br breaking down into four main things so those are those are the four, four main things we're going to talk about today um and i want to mention it's not only for you know digital entrepreneurs like myself or maybe like yourself but it's also for um you know people who want to just do some freelance job you know making a couple thousand dollars on the side or if you are working a nine to five it could still be beneficial for you to keep watching this video so what I noticed um, in the last two and a half years, you know, building my business from literally zero uh, all the way up to like $20,000 per month profit at the age of 26 was that um, success in, um, in businesses like this could be broken down into four um, very simple steps. It's not easy to do them. It's not easy to commit to them, but the steps in itself and the logic behind is super simple. So the first one, is that you have to know where to look for the right knowledge, right? You cannot waste your time, you know, being all over the place um, looking for knowledge. You really need to um, identify what sort of knowledge you want to learn and just and then just go for it and, and start learning it. The second one I notice is that once people understand what they need to learn, they're usually not willing to invest, right? So they 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 watch the free content but they're not willing to invest into their success into um the work of other people more knowledgeable people so that's a crucial one like once you invest into something then you know likelihood that you're gonna ex uh, you know you're gonna um execute is so much higher third one is that once people you know either you're going with free knowledge right or you you are on the next level and you actually invested into yourself and your knowledge then the third one is to really know how to synthesize the information because chances are you don't need all the information. And even though if you read or consume all the content, um, the easiest example is like people reading books, right? They read a book and they, they understand how it should work, but they never really execute on it, right? And so the third one is to synthesize information, to write it down, to think about it, what, is, what it is that I actually need from this information, from this course, from this blog post, from this whatever youtube video right even from this one right you know put out a piece of pen and paper and start you know jotting down things that you wanna remember from this exact video and read it back from a week now right schedule it don't let it slip away from your hands i usually consume content then i whenever i find something valuable i read it out and i schedule it somewhere for review right so that's that's step number three and step number four is really execution and I couldn't guys I couldn't put put enough emphasis on this one people just consume content you know um, they either pay or not pay for it they either invest or don't don't and then they either synthesize the information or not but there are people who do the first three, three steps um, perfectly but they never execute they just consume 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 and they are surprised that they are not successful um, Again, really vague term, success, right? Whatever success means to you. Um, but by and large, and by society, they are not. And they don't uh, think about themselves as successful. The reason behind is they don't really execute, right? I've got friends, and I know things that are life-changing, right? I know books, I know you know podcasts, stuff like that. I've got friends, they, they kind of curious how I make this money in Hungary, right? With my agency. Um, not working my face off and when we get into that conversation some friends of mine um, I give them advice I always try to help them and some people <clears throat> say oh it sounds really good it sounds really cool I'm gonna try it tomorrow they never do that they never try it right and some friends like my friend CLO uh, the DJ guy they are like they are they are savage like he's savage but once he understands how it is beneficial for him he just takes action right away and that really what sets apart from, I would say, you know, guys winning in this, you know, in winning in really 2020 in online businesses and guys that don't. And I think the biggest false and limiting belief of people is 
they don't really start this journey. They don't really, they want to build a business like this, right? They, they, they want to do that. Uh, probably you guys want to do that as well, right? Um, but the reason many people don't do it is because they believe that the secret is in the techniques, tactics, strategies, you know, you know all that, all that stuff. And what you need to understand is it's, it's really none of that. It's more like having a consistent, you know, um, routine, understanding how you're going to move from A to B and really follow it through, right? Understanding the four main steps I just, you know, highlighted for you over here. And I promise you, once you start executing on that four things, your life is going to change. It's not gonna happen right away. So what many people again like mess up is they, they do it, but they do it for like a week or a month. Dude, guys, a month is not enough. If you believe you're gonna you're gonna build anything great in like you know three months, maybe half a year, don't even start it. Save your time, go do something else. You know, you just wanna get some quick cash grab. You're not in it for the long-term success, you don't really have a vision. So don't even don't even go for it if you wanna build something in like half a year and expect, you know. So you have the freedom and money and all that. It could happen, right? But don't start because of that. Um, if your main, and I, and I just want to put it down, if your main motivation is to get a quick, you know, quick cash grab, get money, that's still okay, but don't expect it to happen in like half a year, right? So that's really everything. That's how I feel like in 2020 people get it wrong when it comes to online businesses. So use these three main um, very important steps and uh, come back later. Put a like put a comment on put a comment over here right now. Let me know if you are you know feel like you're gonna execute on this one. If you don't or disagree, put it down. I love to hear. Let's talk about that in the comments. And if you execute, come back you know a month later, half a year later, a year later, and let me know how it worked out. Because I know for a fact that you're not gonna be disappointed, my friend. So. If you like this video, if you found any value in it, if you want me to put out content like this consistently, um, again, like low, really, really low production value, but it's really the message what, what you know, what I want to trans transfer, then let me know. I would create more. Um, you can do that by sharing it. You can do that by subscribing. You can do that by pressing the like button, whatever you prefer, whatever you feel like it's appropriate in this situation. Um, and guys, wish you a great day.